everybody. So I have a small problem with 58 millimeter sacks. It's nothing major. Um, you guys might not even care, but man, it doesn't work for me. Um, you know, and I should have known better when I bought these things. It really doesn't matter. Like, I still love them. It's just a, a, a small issue that I think should be rectified or could have been rectified or could have been done differently. I don't know. This is, it's just something I don't like. So I'm going to tell you about it because generally I just bitch and moan about shit. Um, so I'm going to do it now on this channel soon. Okay, so these are my 58 millimeter sacks. We got a classic SD, a classic SD, a Rambler, a Midnight Manager, and a Mini Champ. We love the Mini Champ. By the way, let's just, let's just express the love for the Mini Champ. Um, but yes, um, I do have an issue with a particular tool on these knives, and. Uh, I'm going to show all you guys what that is in a minute. Alright, so some of the main tools on these little bad boys. Um, you obviously have the small pen blade. It's beautiful and sharp and very handy for a lot of things. The world famous Victorinox scissors, which are just, as we all know, Killer. Um, they're, they're very small these ones but um, hey don't let the size fool ya. you got the, the combo tool which has the uh, bottle opener, wire stripper and a magnetized Phillips head on him. We have a small flathead screwdriver on the end of a nail cleaner go figure um, on some models also a pressurized pen and then on the mini champ <clears throat> we got a smaller pen blade we got an orange peeler works well for opening blister packs we got the small screwdriver on this ruler as you can see but this actually has markings for a ruler on it and the cuticle pusher which you know, could be a coke spoon if you wanted to and is often referred to as that um, because what guy who owns a sack who's you know, doing one things with one of these it needs to um Push his cuticles. I don't know. I've, I've, I've pushed my cuticles in before, and with this, and I'm not really sure what it does. But I'm not a chick either, so you know. If there's any women out there who can explain why I need to push my cuticles? Please let me know. Other than that, yeah, the Mini Champ does have other tools, which are the same. It does have the nail file and the nail cleaner on it. It's got the scissors. It's got the multi-tool and it has the pen blade. Also packs some tweezers. As does all these boys have the tweezers and a toothpick in them as well. So hey, handy little knives. What's ring what's wrong with them? Yeah? What's wrong with them you say? Stick around, you'll find out. Alright, well, there's not necessarily anything wrong with the Mini Champ. I know it's hard to see. I've got these lights shining on there really bad. Um, but the ends of these bad boys all have a flat blade screwdriver on the end of the nail file. That's a classic SD. Stands for screwdriver. This is also a classic SD. Stands for screwdriver. Should be a screwdriver on that. 
This is a Rambler. Why does the Rambler? The Rambler SD, I don't think there's a, such a thing as a Rambler SD. Why does it have this slightly useless little screwdriver on the end that you can't clean your nails with? I'm gonna file my nails. I want to be able to clean them with a nail cleaner. This is a Midnight Manager. Also, with the SD screwdriver blade on it, on the end of the nail file. Mini Champ got it right. Proper little nail file, does its thing, beautiful. On the end of the thing that goes with it. So, who the hell decided that we should put a stupid screwdriver that's not very useful as far as I'm concerned anyway. There's more Phillips heads in the world than there is flatheads now and, and you can undo a flathead with just about anything. Go and get a coin or something. But when you want to clean your nails and file them, I've got scissors on here I can cut them with. I've got the nail file that I can file them with and then I can clean with a proper nail cleaner. This thing just wrecks and just does not it just wrecks under your nail and doesn't even clean so what the I, I don't know go figure but I'm not gonna hold back the surprise anymore problem is freaking non SDs with the SD nail file screwdriver instead of nail file nail cleaner got this bad boy today He's a sportsman, and he's a good sport, <laughs> mainly because instead of a small blade, the thing's got a nail file with a proper nail cleaner. Oh, go figure. The way it should be. So if you're gonna put the screwdriver in, put the screwdriver in. The screwdriver's on, ugh, God, somewhere in here, on the bloody ruler. There it is. Oh, coke spoon. Watch out for that coke spoon, guys. There's the ruler. That I don't know if you can tell it's a ruler. It's got markings on it. There they are. But there's your stupid little flathead that really does not march. It's not good for a pry bar. It's pretty. It's not weak, but it'll pry small things. Goddamn flathead screwdrivers. They're gone. Undo them with something else or put a different tool on like this don't screw up the bloody nail file accessory because it is a good little nail file it does a great job but you can't clean your nails with this stupid flat thing so I'm going to grind them all down or find new bits off old ones of these or anything I can find old classics to turn them into decent nail files or nail cleaners because what the fuck seriously what the nail file screwdriver dumb nail file nail cleaner it's quite easy done I don't know who had the brainstorm but I know myself I'll never buy an SD ever again. I don't want an SD, and if I buy an SD, I'm going to make sure I've got something to pull apart to put a proper nail file, nail cleaner in there because the SD part of it does nothing for me. Um, my problem, not yours. You guys let me know what you think. I'd like to start a discussion about it because, um, yeah, that's fine. I knew I was buying a classic SD. I knew. Well, I didn't know, but I got given a classic SD. Fine, it's a classic SD. But I bought this. I didn't buy a Rambler SD, and I bought this, sight unseen, so, you know, and it, old mate didn't even know what it was. Didn't know that he had a torch on him. Um, suck it, the old mate cost me five bucks. Haha. <laughs> Pays to know what you have before you sell it. Whatever. You're going to put a nail file on it. Put a nail cleaner on the end instead of a stupid screwdriver. Think about it, Victorinox. So clearly the SD range isn't for me. Hey, don't get me wrong. 
I love these little guys. They're great. Um, you know, and if you buy an SD, you, you're gonna get a screwdriver. But I put it on the end of the nail file. Oh, nail file, nail clean. Like, it's just silly. So, thanks for watching. Um, I do love them, don't get me wrong. I just wanted to start a discussion. Someone let me know what you think and how useful it's been for you, you know? Just not for me. Oh, this sack man. Out. Mm -hmm.